So here is an assembled Aqua 105 alarm clock and I'm going to show you how to set the time. So first thing to do is I plug it in and you see the needles move, it goes through its little boot sequence and now you see the AM light is flashing. That is to tell you that it has been rebooted. So the first thing we do is set calibration. So I go into Cal 1 and the idea here is to make sure the needles point properly to full scale. So I turn the adjust dial down until hours points to 12. Similar thing on Cal 2. I adjust the minutes meter down until it points to 60. Uh, when I go back to set the time, so I'm now in time mode, uh, the clock defaults to 5 o'clock uh, p.m. Uh, so it's 5 o'clock somewhere. As soon as you turn the, the adjust knob, the AM light is no longer flashing. Uh, to set the time, uh, you scroll through minutes. If you go fast enough, it will auto scroll like so. So in my house right now, it's a little after noon, so I'm gonna let it run around like that. Oh, this is technically uh, in the morning, just after midnight, so here we go. 6 a.m., 7 a.m., 8 a.m., 9 a.m., I think you get the idea, so I'm just gonna stop there. Uh, same thing, you can also do the same in reverse. Uh, to set the alarm, similar thing. So when you put it in alarm mode, the alarm will flash. It defaults to 9 a.m. You just set it with the adjust knob. So say I've set the alarm for 9.10. Uh, I'll now switch back to time mode. And what I will do is I will press the alarm toggle switch. And now the alarm is armed. To disable it, simply press the toggle switch. Put your switch safety down for, or your safety cover down to, for safety. Um, and that's pretty much it. The last feature, of course, is Warble. Uh, in Warble, normal time is displayed, but all that happens is the clock will twitch like that randomly. Uh, and then by playing with the adjust dial, we can increase the speed of the twitching. Uh, thanks, everybody.